Get out of here. All right. <laughs> no, I'm not telling you guys to get out of here. The freaking virus protection thing that it pops up every once in a while. And as soon as it was doing the countdown to start the video, it popped up. I'm like, get out of here. No, don't start on my video. I'm not sure if you guys saw it or not. But I'm not telling you guys to get out of here. No, you stay. Stay. Watch my video. All right. So, welcome back to Rob and Y. So, today is Wednesday, and that means that we are using Ubaluxes. So, I hope we get one of them good kind of long duels, you know? You know, so, sometimes we have them videos where we get like a, a multiple of duels, a couple of duels in one video. Because I, either my I can't get a good duel or my or my opponent just kicks the crap out of me. Sometimes we get those nice duels where the video is long and it's one duel. And, you know, it's me and my opponent going back and forth, you know? Just like how I think you, you guys should kind of be like. So, I hope that I get... The first one, you know, the long duel. Now, my hand is not good enough to be having a long duel. Got dark graphic, but I got no darks. We have a ton of darks in this deck, and I got no darks, so that's awesome. Nor do I really feel like setting the Galaxy Wizard. I think I might just take the damage on the chin for right now. Unless you just straight up, like, fucking, uh, fucking Galaxy fucking OTKs my ass. So, <laughs> you know, if that's what he wants to do, then hey, more power to you. If you got the OTK, then, oh, you know, OTK it up, sir. Oh, uh, I got a Dark Graffer. I can always use Dark Graffer to pitch a Dark Graffer, but then what the fuck would that do? <sighs> yeah, I guess I could. You know? I guess I could go Dark Graffer, pitch Dark Graffer, send you Bell, and I would have two different levels. Overall, not the best. You know what? Normal Summon? Okay. I said, I don't like this. I don't like, I don't like this. You know? I like Dark Graffer because he helps with the consistency, and this deck does have Dark Monsters, just not more Dark Graffers. Don't like that. So there she is, to go ahead and help us out with him. And also she's level 3, which helps with this. You know, so definitely, definitely welcome to this deck, especially. You know, there's a couple of decks that uh, that might fit in with, but this that one might be the best. You think I should bait? I could bait. But you know what? If he had an MST, he would have said it already. So, all right, let me go ahead and no, no, really? I would say that. I'm just saying. Let me go ahead and get ready and put this in the graveyard. I, look, I have my mouse already open. I'm like, you, like one of those is probably an MST. You're probably gonna MST me, and, and during the end phase, and I'm not gonna get shit. But no, you just passed it up. Like, damn. All right. Okay. Well, I got mass chameleon. We could go for super chocolatey fudge cover. To tell you the truth, we could. We can go summon Mask Chameleon, Mask Chameleon, bring back your bell, activate Galaxy Queen's Light, all 10, XC, Super Chocolate Fudge Cover, wipe his back, bro. We could. Is it worth it, though? You know what? You know what? I'm gonna do it. And you know why I'm gonna do it? The reason why I'm gonna do it is because this is Ubox Seas, and you guys came here to see some XC plays. You know, this deck is not the strongest deck in, in, uh, in Vitamin Wine. Definitely not. It takes a lot, a lot of setup. You know, sometimes we get the hands that are great, sometimes we don't. But, you know, I feel like when we get the hands that are good, we should at least commit to to, to it. Alright, so, I'm gonna summon. In fact, you know what? You guys wanna see some super chocolate fudge covered? I wanna see some super chocolate fudge covered. Let's go into super chocolate fudge covered. How does that sound? That sounds delicious. Alright? So, ah, my ear. My ear. <laughs> Activate. All 10. You know what? You know what? I'm saying that I could go for Super Chocolate Fudge Cover. I want to go for Super Chocolate Fudge Cover. You know what? I have all 10s, and I can XC into anybody. I want Dora. You know, and then your bell can stay on the field. It's effect negated, and then I could just, you know, whenever I want to deal with that, I could just deal with that. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to go into Dora. I'm going to go into Dora. Da, 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 Dora. Yeah. There you go. That's a classic Ubox Seas play. Just I, literally using Jesse Bell's level to allow me to go into Dora with other monsters. Dora. We could have went to Super Chocolate Fudge Cover, but it really wasn't necessary. Oh, he's using BAs. Wow, and he must have opened up like crap. Because clearly he has a lot of back row. This effect is negated. Well, her effect is negated. Like, I'm evil master, you don't think I know? Mask Chameleon summons my monster with the effects negated. 
And you gonna take your turn? Take your turn. You're just sitting here clicking my monster and I'm like, take your turn. It's effects are negated. Like, there is no end phase tribute, whatever. No, my effect is negated. It was negated by Mass Chameleon. You were just gonna sit here? Thank you. So you're using Burning Abyss and you clearly just opened up like poop, I guess. The effect on itself. Chain. Okay, that's fine. Effect. That's fine. I'll summon Terra. I don't mind that. What kind of Burning Abyss deck are you using? You must have opened up like poop. Go ahead. Load it up. And give me that Armageddon Knight. And you know what? Yeah, I'm going to send her because then I will have my other level that I need. Act two! Ah. Ah, someone's talking about me. Uh, you guys talking about me? Making me sneeze? Effect. So there we go. We got three different levels in the graveyard. No really reason for me to attack, because Terra's going to kill the monster anyway. Yeah. No effect. Mm -hmm. My god. Yeah, you're supposed to be using BAs, man. You're supposed to be showing me the, the best deck in the fucking, fucking format. And you're sitting here and getting your ass beat by your belt because you opened up like shit. I, that's my only explanation why no, you're not fucking, you know, beating the shit out of me right now. Oh, okay. So you're gonna rubric me. You're gonna, you're gonna Virgil me, huh? Mm-hmm. Go ahead and use your effect. Did it say Burning Abyss card? You can just call one Burning Abyss card, yep. Yep, yep, yep. It says target one burning abyss card. Okay. Am I activate Oasis? Can you bell? Mm-hmm. I said he must have opened up like the butt. Doesn't Skarm have to be in the graveyard to resolve its effect during the end phase? You know what? I don't know. I don't know. There's a reason why no one plays that card. So, I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Wish I would drop the level eater. You cannot special summon any other monsters that break C summons this turn. You have to get this effect. Okay. Because clearly I gotta do something about that Virgil. I didn't really think about that because he still might have. Oh, and definitely he's gonna have a Burning Abyss in his hand now. I don't even, tell you the truth, I don't even know why I'm trying to do this duel. I'm like, literally, I'm using Yabel against the strongest deck of the format, even though he's running stupid shit like this. And multiple copies of it, too. Like, no. Don't run that card. It's not good. You want to run it? You run call and shit. Like, don't run this. It's really weird. 
Ah. Summon you. Activate you. Get a Galaxy Queen's Light. Activate Messenger in a Bottle. Summon. Actually, I can't activate Messenger in a Bottle because I already have you, Bell, on the field. Damn it! I shouldn't have summoned you, Bell. That was bad on my part. Yeah, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and make defeat now because I'm gonna lose to Burning Abyss and no one wants to duel Burning Abyss in fucking unrated. Like, really? You know? Unrated. Dueling for fun. We're both 100 rating, but you had that fucking experience. So, I guess your rating got reset to back to 100, but you still had your experience. So, you're just like, oh, well, before I hop on to the fucking, you know, rated circuit and then fucking, you know, duel people with Burning the Best, let me go ahead and fucking use this guy as my victim for Burning the Best. Like, no, thank you. I don't. No. 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 I hate Burning the I don't hate burning this, but they're they're way out of my league. You know, I'm getting my shit beat by fucking fucking Evos, and and then you want me to go against Burning Abyss? Like, nah, you can suck my dick. Fucking go duel against Burning Abyss. I don't know. Wow, terrible hand. Where's my Dark Graffer? If I had a Dark Graffer, I wouldn't mind this hand. Got all the Dark Graffers last duel, get none of them this duel. I'm not going against a fucking Synchro deck. Shit. One, I'm tired of everybody dueling with that deck. And two, I'm not going to sit here all day and watch you play with yourself. Hate that deck. Hate that deck. Not because it's good, just because it's such a fucking buzzkill. Man, hold on. This, 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 this. To do what? You know? Virtual Quasar. I don't like I don't like the deck, especially since everybody's using it now. Oh my bad. I mean, I'm bad. I mean, hi. Hi. Wow, this hand is bad. This hand is just terrible. Like wow. All right, drew Ultimate Nightmare and New Bell. So I drew Terror last time, and now it's Ultimate Nightmare and New Bell. So there you go. In one big goal conglomerate vitamin Y video, I've drawn all the E-Bells. One. 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 The only cards that run is three of these two in my hand, so, you know, three faces in my hand, it's like the cards that won. Really? Really? No, I'm not gonna duel against fucking Cleese. Yeah, yeah. A noob with Cleese. Sure. No. No, not gonna fucking duel against Cleese. Burning Abyss and Cleese! Like, damn! What, Shadal's next? Like, what the fuck is going on here? If you're gonna use that top tier shit, take your ass to rate it! Is it that hard? Let me sit and fucking unrate it and get nothing for using the best deck. Like, come on. Take that shit and rate it. We don't want that shit here. I wanna fucking have a good duel. I don't wanna fucking... Fucking get shit, my shit kicked out of me by fucking Cleese. No, thank you. God, I hate Cleese so much. I hate Cleese. I hate Cleese because that deck is just fucking noob friendly. When Burning Abyss, you actually have to think about your plays and do them correctly. You know, the deck can cover you a little bit if you fuck up, but you know, there's still some, you know, some learning curve. With Cleese, fucking what? Asianized girlfriend fucking dueled with it and she kicked some ass and she didn't even know how to play you, Gil. Like I said, that deck is fucking noob, noob friendly. I apologize. So, like I said, I wanted the, a video to be just one single duel, nice long video of a duel. It was pretty good. We got the second one, where we're dueling against shit that we straight up just don't want to duel against. So, yeah. I mean, partially it's because, you know, my hands are straight, but and the other partially is just because I'm going against shit I should not be going against. And, and see, that's what I was worried about in Vibe more. All, all I need is for someone just to think, just want to pick up fucking Cleese. I'm gonna get the shit kicked out of me by Mermels too. I can't keep up with Mermels either. You know what? This is the last duel. This is the last duel. I can't keep up with Mermels either. Why would you do that? Whatever. I said maybe I'm going to get the bad Mermel player, but you know. Just getting completely out of class. This deck's not even meta anymore, but it's still stronger than me. And therefore, I get my butt kicked. It's interesting how it works like that, huh? 
Um, put it in your hand. Thank you. I got message in a bottle. I just need another level. Right now, I only got four, four and ten. I need three or one. I need a different level. Ah, uh, I can exceed. I don't know. Maybe exceed into the level chain and drop it. I'm probably guessing he has an Abyss Sphere, because whenever I duel against Mono, they always have multiple Abyss Spheres. Not just one, multiple. So, could do that. Let's see. Call him with something about. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe Exiton? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to go for it. No summon. Okay. I'm gonna go for it. I'll sit on Terra for a little while. Mermels have a hard time against Terra. That's what they call them haunted. Okay. Yep. Okay. So even when I go next time I have one, two, three, four, five, two. It's one, two, three, four, five, six. Done. Back. You got a response to that? Go ahead. Go bitch for you. Chain a bitch for you. Like, that's fine. Mm hmm. There you go. Like I said. both get our effects, so you get your effect, I get my effect. Yep. So whatever you summon is going to get killed by terror and during the end phase anyway, so I don't give a shit, but it's a squall. Mm. Okay. You had another gun? Yeah, you did. Wow, you're a bad mermaid player. Uh huh. So who are you reviving? I said it really doesn't matter. If you revive Lynn, you only get one effect of Lynn per turn, so. And you only get one. And one effect of this pike once per turn too, so it doesn't matter if you summon him either. It really doesn't matter what you summon. The funny thing is that he's plus so much I can literally Axiton again. Alright, now since that is over, uh, I'm pretty much done, done with my turn. Yeah, I'm pretty much done. No, I got nothing to do. I already summoned, so I'm just gonna end the bell effect. I could have exit time again and turned Terra an ultimate, but I, I mean, yeah, an ultimate, but I'd rather have uh, Terra right now. All right, so let me see what Mermels will do against Terra, because usually they're dumb and they generally are like, oh, I can go into sevens, ah, uh, go into freaking big eye, take your roster, like, damn it, I don't give a shit. So literally, he has two of those fucking Mermel guys that summon the Mermel from your fucking hand. I forgot what her name is because she's not relevant. You know, pitch gun to get fucking her, like, hello? Wow, he's literally gotten all his pikes. Interesting. 
Mm-hmm. Wow, and all his guns. Wow. So what was so so what was your open hand? Hand. Three pikes and three gun? Like Like shit. Like pipe gun, pipe gun, pipe gun, pipe gun. That's literally how you've done all duel. It's pipe gun, pipe gun, pipe gun, pipe gun, like what the fuck? I can tell. Well, if it makes Castell, that will suck, because I won't even get my effect. So I get fucked up by Virgil, and I get fucked up by Castell. It's the reason why he's fucking Terror is just not as good as it used to be, because I keep on getting spun back to the deck. No, I do not get my effect. If you're gonna ask, like, do you get your effect? You would move from the field. Like, no. Terror can't resolve in the deck. Those are effects can't activate in the deck. Yeah, Normals don't have a lot of fours, so I'm trying to figure out, you know. But, you know, since they don't have a lot of fours, it's probably a good chance they're just gonna, they are gonna run Castell, because Castell is, you know, a go to four. Uh, I guess he doesn't have a four. Like I said, I'll take the duel slow. I'm cool. Alright. That play was really anticlimactic and a real neg. Like I said, all you needed was Castell. It's your fault you don't have Castell in your extra deck. Go ahead. Um, I still need to get one more monster at a different level. Like number generator. Give me level eater. Give me Harris. I don't give a shit. <gasps> give me someone. Give me an Armageddon Knight. I don't care. Give me someone just to send that last level so I can make use out of meshes in a bottle. So right now, I cannot make use of that card that well. Yeah, that's fine. Who are you gonna send? Who, uh, infantry? Is infantry the one that pops face up? I can't remember if it's Marksman. I think Marksman pops f set and an infantry pa pops face up, right? I don't know. I don't know. I get those two confused. Infantry, right? Infantry pops face up? Yep, I was right. Go ahead and say effect. Alright. What's my name? You done? So I was right. Infantry pops the face up and Marksman pops the set. That's fine. You gonna end your turn? Is that it? Or you got something else? I know so much of your hand. I know like three cards in your hand. Galaxy Queen's like. Mm. That's not what I want. <laughs> like I said, I got that. Like I said, I would love a, something to send. I need. A, I would love a level modulator. Uh, I mean, not a level modulator, a sender. You know. I want level eater. I want Harris. I want Armageddon Knight. Not Dark Greffer. We got Dark Greffer. Not very often you get to see Terra and Ultimate Nightmare up a whole in the field, so fuck it. You think you're gonna go ahead and pop me with your little fucking mark? If you're like, no, I'll just restart, I'll just hit the restart button and summon you bell again, and again, and again, and again, and again. All I need is goddamn Armageddon Knight! Rhoda, Armageddon Knight, fucking level eater, Harris itself, come on. 
I see I get one more level in the graveyard, and then maybe we can start having some fun. Not even having any fun right now, because I can't really do shit. Why are you going to blind space me and then do nothing with it? You know? Seems like you just drew into the MST and just threw it at me. Like, why? That's probably Gen X controller, if I were to guess. You done? Shit. We're sitting here staring at each other. Are you done with your turn? You MST, you said a monster. Now what? Are you done with your turn? Ah, oh, thank you. She was right there. She was like, hey man, I'm right here. Like, I got you. I got you right now. I'm gonna go ahead and send you. Wow, you didn't even sh really shuffle from your place, did you? There we go. Alright. Alter Nightmare Attack. You know the drill. Max. Oh, no. He has to decide to send you down. Uh huh. This is sent to the graveyard. You have another Mermel in your monster except for a hill to summon? This card sends to the graveyard. You can special summon one Mermel monster from your hand except for a hill. So don't use the effect of hill. No, no. Okay. Good. There you go. Not gonna use the shit I message in the bottle. Depending on what he does, I might be able to just end this duel. Especially if he doesn't play a monster, I might end this duel with a super chocolatey fudge covered. You guys want it, and I will supply. Oh, pitch Tia summon Tia. Wow. All right. That's fine. Pitch Tia summon Tia. You know what you should have did? Fucking pitch gun. <laughs> but no, you used them all. <laughs> I'm sorry. Remember those take a little bit of skill, sir. Purge? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Hold on, I'm thinking. One, two, three, seven. Not tonight. All ten. Super chocolate punch from the door. Tack, tack. Yeah, I think I got something, guys. I think we might be able to end this. Alright, I have the right message in the bottle. I am going to summon Ebel, Harris, and I really don't give a shit. It doesn't matter. Then I'm going to uh, normal summon the fairy searching the fairiness. Activate Elixir Queen's Light. All ten. Gonna overlay you with you with you, and we're gonna go ahead and make a super chocolatey fudge covered, and we're gonna overlay you with you. And we're gonna go ahead and go into a dot 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 Dora. Tack. There you go. That was good. And super chocolatey fudge covered attack. Ah! Woo! That was good. <laughs> Alright, so, besides doing against that freaking Burning Abyss guy who's going to kick the shit out of me, or that Creeper guy who's going to kick the shit out of me, going against a bad Mermel player, keep in mind, bad, we're going to pull something off, so, that's good. 
That ending, though. That ending. Give this video a like just for that ending. <laughs> all right. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow using uh, Cosmic Eval. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.